I know what you're thinking. How the hell is his lawn that green? It is hot. Everyone and their mom has swamp ass right now. How is this so green? <laughs> well, I have a secret for you. Everyone thinks I'm crazy because I have multiple water times every single day. I mean, the sprinklers are just going. But what's funny is I'm putting down the same amount of water as you are. You see how green this is? It's blazing. Pants were a bad choice. I'm gonna show you what the other lawns usually look like around this time in the summer. Yep. Yep. <laughs> you can take a walk around the whole neighborhood and every grass looks like this. I can't make this up. Look at that. Crispy, bare spots. I mean, that's wheat. That's straight up wheat. But why does mine look like this? Dark, lush. Where's the dry spots? This was a dry spot, literally, three days ago. Why is it thriving and lush now? The process, syringing. No, you're not injecting something into your lawn. It's called syringing. <laughs> In your 20s, you like to network, go on golfing trips. A couple of times, you're in the summer, just golfing, you're like, man, it is so hot out here. Where's the cart girl? Where's our Arnold Palmies? And then you're seeing another cart, and you're like, what is this guy doing? Then he hooks up a hose, and he starts spraying the greens. You're like, yo, dude, I'm about to putt. What the hell are you doing? And then he sprays. Middle of the day, it's super hot. Then he rolls it out. What did he do? He syringed the greens. So what he's doing is, is he's cooling off the turf. He's cooling off the grass, just like you would if you had like a fan with a mister in the heat of the summer. That cools off your grass. I mean, proven to drop temps in the soil. Not much, but just enough to make it not go crispy. Yeah, it's a thing. Now, the funny thing is, I literally put down the same amount of water as you guys. For those of you that are, that are watering right now, because some of you guys aren't even watering. <laughs> Inch and a half every single week. Here, I'll just tell you my water schedule. 20 minutes in the morning, 10 o'clock in the morning, another two minutes, one in the afternoon, another two minutes, four o'clock in the afternoon, another two minutes. Syringing, baby. Why do you think my stuff is so green? You have to let it cool off. A lot of traditional guys will say, just water in the morning, because there's gonna be a lot of disease pressure if you keep watering this much. You're just, you're just watering too much. No, you're not. This is a different level. This is lawn annihilation. This is a different level of the game. You can water every morning and just let it cook in the afternoon. Go for it, see what happens. You're wasting all that water. Because yeah, you're keeping it healthy, healthy and dormant. <laughs> this is cool season grass. It hates the heat. So you have to trick the system. You have to make sure that it's thinking it's still spring. That's the key to the success of this lawn, syringing. How do you do it? Let me show you. If you have an irrigation system, this is a lot easier. So I use the Beehive app. Like I said, 20 minutes in the morning, like four in the morning. 10 o'clock, a little spritz. One o'clock, a little spritz. Four o'clock, a little spritz. You wanna make sure that your last water time and that last zone has enough time to dry up before nightfall, right? You don't want that moisture sitting on top of that grass. That's gonna press that disease to just come into your lawn. You don't want that. So make sure your syringing is definitely done by the time nightfall comes. It needs to be dried up. So what we're gonna do is, this spot right here, two minutes. Two minutes, that's all we need. So we'll go here, set it for two minutes, and watch the magic. We're gonna get sprayed and I need it because I'm hot. Gah! Ah, yeah. See, I'm already cool. My body is a couple degrees cooler now. <laughs> oh, I can't wait for it to come back. Look at that. It's getting in there and just cooling off. It's hot right now. Yeah. See, now I'm cool. Sheesh, it's hot. So if I'm hot and I'm cooking, you know the grass is cooking. And I mean, I'm already cooler with just that little bit of spritz. Here it comes again. Flash dance. Oh, the wind. The wind blocked it. <laughs> oh, look at that. Look at the droplets on the lens. Yeah, well, we're gonna wait here until, until it stops. And I'll show you how wet the grass got in two minutes. That is fantastic. We're coming up to about two minutes right now. See, it's done. It's done, it turned off. How wet did it get? Oh my gosh, you can already tell. The grass itself feels like way cooler. It was getting a little hot, hot to the touch. <laughs> now it's cool to the touch. Lovely. Yardbird, what if I don't have an irrigation system? Well, I just have an above ground. I just have a timer. But if you have to hand water, like you have a small lawn and you have to hand water, that's cool. Hit it up there. Five minutes, 
sprinkle everything real quick and you're done. You'll notice a big difference, guys. Huge, huge difference. Like I've been doing this for about two years now. Everyone thought I was crazy. Everyone in the neighborhood was like, damn, why is this guy watering so much? I even had a couple people, why do you water so much? I don't. You set your water timer in the morning for 30 minutes. I set mine for 20, right? And then two, four, six more minutes throughout the day, two minutes at a time. That's 26 minutes. They're doing 30. I'm saving water. And the lawn couldn't look any darker. I mean, it's like, please stop putting the iron on me. Jesus. I've had enough. No, you haven't, bro. We're gonna iron this weekend. <laughs> at the end of the day, you're gonna want to do things the modern way. You want to strategically plan your summer water schedule. This is a completely different game, like I said. You saw the neighbors, crispy. It's like a desert out there. Yeah. Even the camera's getting a little syringe. <laughs> All right guys, that is my summer tip. Do that, see what happens. It's gonna be amazing, like this, look at it. We're, we're all nice and cool now from this heat. It's hot out here, it's so hot. Now water alone is not gonna cure everything for the summer heat. So watch this video right here and this will help you put down some products that'll definitely help out. You guys are the best. We'll catch you in the next video. Thank it easy. You need to cool off your grass. You need to cool off the lawn. You don't want it sitting there just thirsty. I mean, you don't go around just parched everywhere. And if you do, damn, put a piece of gum in your mouth. <laughs> Show hot ass breath. Damn, get, get out of my face, please. We can talk lawns, just back up. <laughs>